So today I'm out in uh, southern New Jersey, uh, hoping to find some shark's teeth and other Cretaceous age fossils. This site's a bit trickier than some of the, the Monmouth County sites that I go to. There's not quite as much here, but I've had some luck in the past, so hopefully we'll have some good luck today. It was a uh, kind of a last minute decision to come out here. I was just driving by the area and I, uh, I figured I'd stop and hunt for a bit so I don't have my boots with me. So it'll be uh, sneakers for the day. I'm gonna try to stay dry best I can. We've got the first one of the day right here. There's no root on it. Would have been a nice sized goblin shark. Cool colors on it, but we'll keep looking, see if we can find some more complete ones. I don't know if you guys can see it all that well, but right here is the root of a tooth. Let's see if it's whole. Ooh, nice. Yeah, it is. Nice crow shark. It's in really good shape for this site. It's got the full root. Even can see some serrations, which usually get, uh, they're usually worn down from this site uh, compared to the other sites that I look for these at. There you go, this is a pretty good one. Looks like the tip might be busted, but it's got the root on it. That's another goblin shark tooth. This is just a lateral. Instead of the uh, the anteriors are more narrow but longer and pointier than the laterals are. Just found this little snail, Steinkern. Pretty nice. You can find some really nice ones of these here that are uh, pyritized, which just means they're replaced with pyrite, and it gives them a really cool, like golden shine. That's a uh, one of the last videos I posted was a video of probably the nicest one I've found here. But, uh, be cool if we could find some more just like that. Found a cool little snail shell that's been, uh, piratized. Let's see if we can get it in the sun for you. Get a better look at how shiny it is. It's only a piece, but the, the golden shine on it's really nice. Just pulled these two out of the last sift. You got one little crow shark and one of what's likely a small lateral goblin just based on the general uh, composition of the sharks you find here. Um, they're both in all right shape. They're both kind of beat up, especially that little goblin. Probably only going to stay out for like 15, 20 more minutes. I found this other one right after I turned the camera off for that last clip. This one's actually really nice. It's got the full point, really nice root, and pretty cool colors too. Doing pretty well these last few minutes. Just found this one on the uh, on the bank. It's got some nice colors again, really worn down, but that's that's ninety percent of the teeth here are going to be stream worn, or not even stream worn. It's some side cusps. You can kind of see them. They're little nubs, not even really pointy anymore. Still a nice find though. Just found this one in the sifter. It's pretty cool. It's, it looks like all the color's been leached out of the enamel. It's pretty dulled down and fragile. Would have been a pretty nice one if the tip wasn't broken. Let's see if we can get some light on it there. Yeah. It's got a good root. Just tips broken off. Always seems to go that way. Oh, and actually, there's one right here on the surface. Nice crow shark. It's got some really cool colors to it, sort of a white and blue. Nice. I think I'm going to head back now. Head back up to the 
parking lot. I uh, had some pretty good luck today, but uh, it's starting to get dark. I want to head back before I have to we'll do what I'm doing right now when it's uh, dark out.